Colonel Groves, I see something in the distance. Oh my god! Okay, man, let me try something out. Mentira! Yeah! Tengo debajo en mi cama cuatro aeropuerto. Mentira! We've got a brand new mic. You guys are gonna have to let me know in the comments whether this mic actually sounds sick. It's a new road mic. It's not an ad, I bought it myself. It's the same mic that Pi got for his stream, and I saw him use it, and I was like, I gotta have that, so I overnighted it. And I think it's actually sick. Let me know if it's good. Hit that like button if you guys think the quality's great. But we're not here for a mic. We're here for one of the most emotional cards we've seen all year. Sick. <laughs> Bull something, boys, and it's so weird for me talking into this mic down here. Usually my mic's up there. Bull something, boys, and welcome to the Europa League moments. Radamal El Tigre Falcao SBC. Possibly the cheapest SBC we've seen for one of these high-rated players. Almost almost a 90-rated version of Radamel Falcao. The dis... I was about to say disputable. The undis... undis wait, what's the word? Undisputable? The un... Something. Whatever word it is. The undisputed. Undisputed king of Europa League is back at it again with a incredible looking card. Now there are some downsides to his card, but the downside has nothing to, to do with the price of his SBC. Comes in just under 50,000 coins on the Xbox. Uh, decided to throw in an 83 untradeable one front, and then outside of that, a very, very cheap SBC to get done. So... Uh, you guys are probably wondering, you guys are probably, you know, you probably have already done it by the time you're watching this video just because it is such an affordable card. Incredible shooting stats and then also has some nice dribbling stats to boot. He's got the four star weak foot, obviously doesn't have the skills, but uh, a very sexy looking card. I'm going to have to say I kind of like this one over the Champions League one. Don't ask me why, and of course we had to fix the jungle kit on him because uh, his nickname is El Tigre or the king of Europa League, uh, Radamo Falcao. Uh, gets us a cheeky little card and uh, one of the most emotional players a very very much a channel legend sort of a guy who fl has flown under the radar as a channel legend but we're gonna look at his card right now obviously like I just said the four star three star Ligon and Colombian we're gonna put together a full Colombian side to all my Colombianos out there dude we're about to put together a very sick side un equipo increíble 95 finishing 95 composure 99 jumping and 96 heading accuracy a lot of people uh, it, this was this card was leaked yesterday and people on Twitter are like this card doesn't look great at all. I'm sorry, but those stats are some of the best stats that you're going to get for attacking player. I know he doesn't have the pace. He's got 76 pace, but we're going to slap a Hunter Chem style on him, and he's going to instantly or should instantly become one of the best aerial threats in all of FIFA, period. 96 heading accuracy, 99 jumping. I'm sorry. Like, what am I missing there? Plus 98 uh, attacking positioning. Drop a like on the video if you guys are enjoying the content. Uh, if you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below, but I did promise you guys a full Colombian side. We're going to go ahead. We're just going to take the coins. We're going to take the 32,000 coins, and that right there, whatever we play, um, uh, the matches that we play over the course of the week, just literally funded, you know, 80% of that SBC, which is really cool. So, we've got UCL Juan Cuadrado, we've got UCL Davinson Sanchez, uh, Ndave Ospina, we've got Arias, we didn't, I think he's got an 84 inform, no, he has an 82 inform, which is higher rated than his foot miss. We're going with Murillo, we're going with Fabra, uh, and then, like I said, Muriel, and then Hamesito goes for 10,000 coins less than his UCL card, but his UCL card is 10,000 coins more expensive, I'm pretty sure. Freddy Guarin, an absolute mad lad legend. Uh, and then, like I said, we are going to go over, and of course, we're going to slot our main man in. Where is he? Come on. Get in the squad. He's going to look so sick in this squad. Zapata's got, uh, Zapata's got four star, three star. He's six two. You know what? I want to... I want to put uh, Falcao on the other side. We're going to slot Falcao on the right. We're going to get into our first match. We're going to see if we can absolutely yang it up with one of the most Colombian legends of all time. Let's get into match number one. Los Gates. Someone on Twitter just said he's horrible. I will but only submit into an SPC just for the packs. Very cheap. Yeah, he is a very cheap card, but I'm sorry. Is it just pace? Like, are people just concerned with... Are people just concerned with pace? Hold on, let me... Falcao. Radamel Falcao with a Hunter Chem style, turns into a 91 rated striker with 86 pace and 96 shooting. Maxes out his, I, I don't know, dude. Falcao versus uh, Ibrahimovic. We're about to test out the battle of the aerial beasts. The lion versus the tiger. Oh damn, that's actually sick. I believe he becomes the fifth highest rated striker in, in Ligue 1. <laughs> this is honestly, are you Oi. kidding me? That's such a trash FIFA goal to concede. Hold on. Uh, France Ligue 1. Sort by striker. 
Yeah, he actually becomes... Yeah, behind, behind, only behind Edison Cavani. And he's tied with Kylian Mbappe for, uh, for the highest rated striker in, in Ligue 1. Run him up! Oh my god! Juan Cuadrado? Of all guys, it's freaking, uh, it's Jaden Smith that puts it through on a header. We've got our goal. We conceded kind of a shy threat goal, but um, we've got our one goal. Falcao has still not erupted yet. There's only one Zlatan. So far, Ibra one, Radamel Falcao, nil. What a finish! Radamel Falcao, and we are going to be doing the Colombian Dubke this time. Let's go, dude. Come on, 62nd minute, a beautiful, beautiful finish. I thought when I released that off Quadrado, it was going to come a little bit too late. But um, Quadrado was able to make up for it with that incredible finishing and that attacking positioning. Look at that finish right there. Touch perfect. It doesn't get much better than that. card is trash seriously step to me dude step to me right now for 50,000 yeah fantastic value 100% we're doing this card on the on the on the RTG there's no question about it this game sucks what the hell was my defender doing there man GCW yo Colombia, B. Colombia, vive Colombia. Let's go. Come on, boys. The crossing Cuadrado. Uh, sorry, uh, crossing Falcao, El Tigre to Jaden Smith. Let's go, boys. Come on. 4-3 in the 90th minute. The game winner in the very last moment. I, I think more than any other player, I sort of suffer from having to really like focus and adjust to a new player and a new whatever. We haven't used the 4-4-2 in like, I don't know, a week or so. But two goals... And in his, uh, two goals from Cuadrado, two goals from Falcao, and then an assist. So three goal contributions in a match where we scored four goals. A very nice first match. And I'm going to have to say, I mean, he, he paid for his 50,000 coins. He, he paid for his whatever we put in, uh, 40,000 coins. I think we did it for free. We didn't have to buy a player. We already had everything in the club. Okay, I'm reloading. Cuadrado. Hello everyone, uh, we are here with uh, David Ospina. What the hell is going on, dude? It's like freaking beach volleyball simulator. David <laughs> No, wait, ref. There has been a new patch, right? Has it, I don't think it's been released on uh, on console yet. I think it came out on PC. They further slowed down goalkeeper movements, which I think is great. I think it should be taken out altogether. For uh for FIFA 20, and how uh, that's about that's about what 65 crossing should look like. Quadrado. If this isn't a goal. I'm putting the game up in the- come on! Let's go! Zapata! It was Zapata's turn. Duban Zapata. Did you see- dude, my guys are running full steam. It's almost like his defenders- His defenders were scared of my guys, dude. I had like two guys that were open. It was either gonna be James, uh, El Tigre, or Zapata. And Zapata, dude, as we know, he's got that ability as well. The only downside on his card is the agility. If we click on, uh, Radamel Falcao, and you want to know what? 83, he feels a little slower than 83 agility. So I'm wondering if maybe the Hunter chem style isn't the right play. I'm wondering if something like Hunter, sorry, uh, maybe something like Engine or even Marksman because 76 pace is not bad. Like 76 pace is doable. Lock it in. One Quadrado, lock it in. How do you miss? I'll tell you who wouldn't have missed that. Freaking El Tigre. 
destruction. I don't know how these keepers are saving that. Dude, keepers are keepers have apparently been super juiced. Keepers have apparently been super juiced. Luis Muriel. Let's go! Radimo Falcao! El Tigre gets up in the air. And that is exactly what you expect from him. 67th minute. 2-0, and we are up to four goal contributions in two matches played with 89 Falcao. Again, you're not watching this video to see if he's worth the cost. You're watching this video to see if you actually do the SPC. Is he worth using as a player? Because I think a lot of people are going to use this card as SPC fodder. An 89 rated card for 40,000 coins is a absolute bargain. Plus, you get packs back, right? Oh, oh, look, 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 look. Oh, la, la. Oh, oh, la, la. I, I didn't see. I, I see. I didn't see. see. Referee? He's the... No. Okay. Apparently, this, this ref's racist against Carlos Vives. La misma la gota fría. 80th minute. Please don't do this to me. We need the two wins. We can't, we can't draw a loss in the Falcao Epi. It just can't happen. The second we scored that second goal, oh, that was our that was the kith, that was the kiss of death. I was about to say kith of death. Uh, we get a goal with Zapata, we get a goal with Falcao, two very nice goals, but damn it, dude, Fire Spartan, you know what? Good on you for coming back. He didn't give up. He was down two 0 Division rivals. It gets very very competitive, uh, but we are gonna end it. Damn it! At least I mean at least it's not a loss, right? So we get a win and we get a draw and we go up to something like four or five goal contributions in two matches played with El Tigre. But now, the moment of truth. Player pack and then the mega pack. Okay, so let's see. What do we get here? This is the lesser of the two packs. It's not going to light up. Do we get ourselves a board? We do. Board, Spain, right wing, pe uh, Calion? No. Uh, okay, 83 Lucas Lucas Vasquez. 83s and 84s are going uh, going for a record amount right now, I think, because of the SBCs that are that are available. Piccini, Guerrero, Tammy Abraham, Toko Okambi, and then Mundi. And then in our mega pack... We don't get it, but can we get back-to-back -back boards? And we do. Okay, so you know what? I'm not going to complain. Spain, goalkeeper. Hey, Kepa. Kepa Resbilaga. Oh, sorry, 84. Let's go. Uh, that is a 7, 8,000 coin card right there. Hold on a second. Let me just uh, double check that so it doesn't sound like I'm talking out of my culo. 84, uh, 6,200 coins. I'll take it. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. Again, a no-brainer a no SBC just because how cheap it is in the packs that you get and then also the fact that you get a card, you can submit an SBC. If you're running a Liga Insider or a Colombian squad like I am, uh, you can get him done for very, very cheap or next to nothing. But I'm going to give him two thumbs up. He scored some bangers for us. He came in very, very clinical. Didn't really feel as agile as his card reports, but his finishing was nuts. His uh, his aerial ability is obviously one of the reasons that you're going to sign him up into your squad. And in my opinion, works best alongside a speedy striker and then some wingers that have some crossing ability. Not like Muriel does. He only got 65 crossing. But anyway, boys, hopefully you guys have enjoyed the epi. Don't forget to let me know what the audio quality on the mic sounds like in the comments. If you guys did enjoy, drop a like on the video. If you guys are new to the channel, Hit that subscribe button down below. I will see you guys for a double upload tomorrow. Till next time, bros. Tschüss. Later. Adeh.